Hi guys, Boris Dorfman here with LBC Capital Income Fund. If you're not subscribed to this channel, please do so right down below. Uh, if you like the video, like, share, please comment. YouTube algorithms pick this up and uh, make this video more watchable and more people see it. So please do this for me, subscribe and comment. I want to talk to you about the, what we're doing here at LBC Capital and I have a great big announcement. Uh, what the hell, I'll do it now. We are opening a second class of fund. It's an opportunity fund. We also take in investments for specific projects. We're trying to diversify investments from our uh, larger individual investors. So I'll talk about this in more detail later. Uh, I want to touch about uh, on the economy, uh, what Fed is doing and interest rates. Uh, we're not getting any breaks from the Fed. Every time they speak, uh, interest rates keep going up. I was calling for the rates to come down early in 2024, and for now they've been rising. Uh, last time, about six months ago, when Fed spoke, they said they're gonna cut interest rates four times in 2024. Uh, more recently, in September, they came out and said that they may or may not have another hike in November this year and they expect only two cuts uh, in 2024 instead of four. Uh, Fed is worried about uh, inflation going on for longer and uh, they're stuck to their 2% target rate. Also, oil has been going up, that's not helping. This Friday, we're gonna see a PCE report, personal uh, consumption expenditure report. That's uh, Fed's favorite measure of inflation. Like I said before, there's two numbers. There's headline number that includes everything. Uh, it should go up just because oil went up in price a lot over the past uh, month. And the core number, that's really the number the Fed is watching. It should fractionally go down. It was 4.2 uh, last uh, month, uh, year over year. Um, it's uh, uh, the expect market expectations are for four or 3.9%. Again, these figures may be boring, but they're very important. Keep in mind, Fed's, uh, Fed has set their eyes on 2%. So we're still far away from their 2% target. Uh, but we are well on the way, you know, like we're at four, we used to be at nine at the peak. I'll keep updating you guys. We're well on the way, but uh, given that uh, all these hikes are lagging about nine months, Fed is well aware of it, but they're looking for economy to dip or they're looking for people to start losing jobs, which is not happening fast enough. I'll keep you guys updated. Now about the announcement. We are opening LBC Capital Opportunity Fund. It's gonna be a little bit riskier. It's gonna be a lot more adventurous. The lock-in period is gonna be three years at least. Uh, we're gonna have a higher minimum investment uh, and we're gonna have a much higher return. We target 12% uh, yearly return on this fund, but the lock-in period is going to be longer. Uh, it's also going to be very safe fund, but it's going to be a lot more fun. We're going to deal with non-performing assets. We're going to deal with development. Uh, we're going to deal with a lot more stuff. So call me for more details if you'd like to invest in that fund. We also have individual projects that we're working on. Uh, there's a little bit of distress in the market now. There is a way to pick up. Uh, development or uh, investment projects for much cheaper and uh, yeah subscribe down below and i'll be bringing you more opportunities next time thank you guys